so I guess I have to be that guy again, you know. Um, this is my response to Thunderdome. <laughs> he's a cool guy, man, but I think he's just a little, uh, you know, a little biased and a little prejudiced. But it's all good, man, you know. Everyone's entitled to their own opinion, right? So here's my opinion. Um, you know, he made an hour-long video about uh, Thomas Hauser, you know, IV fiasco again, and, um, which is cool, you know, um, I've never read anything on Thomas Hauser, uh, because we know what type of person Thomas Hauser is, we know that he has an agenda, he is extremely biased, and he's extremely vengeful for Floyd Mayweather and other fighters. Al Heyman, Floyd Mayweather, etc., etc. So that's number one. Okay. Um, you know, you could take that how you want it. If you're on the um, anti-Mayweather parade, then you'll believe anything that comes out of guys like Thomas Hauser and thunderdome and you'll believe that type of stuff you know <clears throat> honestly me looking at this objectively you know like i said um like i said i work in medicine you know when i first heard about this you know it was kind of shocking to me but then i started to hear a little bit more of more pieces and pieces um of the story well, not the story, but the allegations, so forth, that this guy is making. Um, and one part that always stood out to me as to why this whole thing is bullshit was the 750 milliliters. That right there was the, the key for me. Okay. Um... For those who don't know, um, 750 milliliters um, is the equivalent to about 25 ounces, you know. Um, a can of soda is 12 ounces, okay? I'm gonna post, okay, I'm gonna post a pic of a IV of 750 milliliters so you guys can see how much this is, okay? And, um, you know, you can make your own call. You know, I'm trying to be as partial as I can because you guys say I'm a quote-unquote flow-mo and all this stuff. I'm trying to be partial, okay? 750 mLs, milliliters, is equivalent to 25 ounces, okay? A can of soda is 12 ounces, right? So... That's basically about two cans of soda or a bottle of beer is 12. Most bottles of beer are 12 ounces. So that will be the equivalent of two bottles of beer. So. And. The, the, the allegation is that Floyd took. 750 mLs of saline, which. Um. If, if, if those who don't know, saline is sterile water. The allegation is Floyd took 750 mLs of saline or two bottles of beer or two cans of soda of sterile water. And that is used to mask PEDs. So in Thunderdome's video, he said that... You know, he tried to cover up, you know, cover himself, which is a smart thing. He said that, you know, I'm not accusing Floyd of taking PEDs, which we all know he is, but that's what he said. And he said that, um, he then later in the video said that he took, he believed he's taken, uh, he took amphetamines or Adderall, okay? Amphetamines like Adderall or methamphetamine, not methamphetamines, just amphetamines. 
he said that Thunderdome said that that's what he believes Floyd took. So you mean to tell me that I can go on a binge, I can go on a binge at night on Adderall and methamphetamine, and um, I can just drink two bottles of beer worth of water. And that will mask my test. Is is that what this allegation is? Because, I mean, that just doesn't add up. You know, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> you know, it's just not that easy. You know, it just... That's the part to me that, you know, that automatically made me dismiss the whole story. Because if he was going to mask PDs, you know... It would take a lot more than just 750 mLs. Just trust me on that. And for some reason, man, you guys just, for some odd reason, I don't know if you guys are just not informed or I don't know. But for some reason, you guys feel that taking an IV is not as effective as just drinking a cup of water, um... To rehydrate yourself and that's totally false okay um first of all you first of all if you're taking a uh so basically that means if you take iv you know whatever you take iv whether it's medication whether it's fluids which is hella common um if you take it intravenously it's going straight into your bloodstream which is going to be absorbed much faster and is going straight to your heart and it's getting pumped through your whole system much faster than this ingesting it orally. I mean, I mean, dude, it's just, you know, it, it's hard for me not to call you guys names, man, because it's just so incredibly dumb, man. Like it doesn't it doesn't even make sense, man. You really think if you take something orally is better than taking it through IV? <laughs> All right, man. Let's not get off topic here. But anyway, dude, made me lose my train of thought. Anyway, stupid ass. Anyway, um, this whole thing is bullshit, man. I mean, I don't know whether the guy is clean or not. But I know for damn sure using Thunderdomes and Thomas Hauser's logic will never have anyone getting caught on drugs because shit, all you need to do is take 750 milliliters of IV and of, of, of saline to mask to mask any drug or to mask amphetamines and steroids and shit. <clears throat> it doesn't even add up, man. It doesn't even add up, you know. Um I don't know, man. You guys need to look and reach and go find another smoking gun because this is not a smoking gun. Um, this is a guy who's severely delusional, a guy who's butt hurt that Pacquiao lost, a guy who would go through leaps and bounds to um, throw salt on another man's name. Um, that's Thomas Hauser. You know? Um... There's no real other way I can put it. 750 ml is not going to cover up a drug test, man. Two bottles of water. <laughs> I mean, dude, I mean, I could, I, could, I could see if you, you know, you said a couple, you know, a couple gallons or something, man. But 750 ml, you... I don't know what to tell you guys, man. It's just, you know, just because you read some shit on the internet, it's not true. Um, obviously, someone told this guy, Thunderdome, that an anti-aging clinic is blood doping. Um, I suggest you do your homework, because you don't know what you're talking about on that either. Um, I can go into that and explain that, but I'm not. Um, just do your homework, man. Um, 
I'm going to just say that it works a little bit like a dialysis machine, okay? You take blood out. And that's a whole nother story, man. But all I'm going to say is, um, you know, you can't believe everything these, these idiots put on the internet, man. You know, a guy like Thomas Hauser, he doesn't have credibility at all. Um, for the simple fact that, you know, he's on a witch hunt. You know, you could say the same thing about anybody, man. You could say, I don't have credibility. You can say anybody doesn't have credibility, but that whole story doesn't even add up. And I know you're going to say, oh, it's water protocol and all this other bullshit. Um, maybe it is, okay, but you're insinuating that this is to cover up PDs. You know, we don't know, you don't know, no one knows, unless you work for WADA or you have um, the WADA rules and regulations to say what, what their rules and regulations are on IVs and why do they deem that unsafe or a violation or whatever the case may be. You don't know. I don't know. But, all, but what I do know is that 750 mLs is not going to make you pass a drug test. Okay? That's not going to cover up drugs that's in your, ingested in your system. It's just not going to happen. It doesn't matter what it is. Drugs, steroids, what? Amphetamines, cocaine, marijuana. I mean, if we, lose, if we use Thunderdome's logic, we'll have... No one will be locked up in jail for drugs. No one will get caught up. No one would lose their job because of drugs because all we need is two bottles of water and we're good to go, right? It's your boy JT. I'm out.